This program is brought to you by Emory University. Before you upload a file or image, make sure you've done any edits on your own computer, such as resizing, optimizing, or renaming. Now that your file is ready to go and has a web-friendly name and size, determine which folder this file will live under. For sites created by the college, all files live in a subfolder underneath assets. Typically, PDFs and Word or Excel documents will live under a folder called Documents, which, remember, lives under Assets. Images, on the other hand, live underneath a folder called Images, duh, which again, lives underneath Assets. Your next step, whether you're uploading a file or an image, is to click on New, and then Image, File, or PDF next to the square red icon. Scroll down to the Browse button to search for the file you want to upload. After selecting the file to upload, you have the option to rename the file. Keep in mind, the three-letter extension, such as .pdf or .jpg, must be included in the system name at the end for files to display properly when they get published to the web server. If you don't change the system name, the original file name will be used, and, you know, since you've probably done most of your edits before you started this process, that'll work fine. The parent folder is where the file will live. If the folder location is wrong, you can change it by clicking the folder icon, browsing to the correct location, and choosing Confirm. Now that your name's right, click the Submit button. If it worked, you'll see the green bar of Go saying, Asset created successfully. Congratulations! You've uploaded a file. In case you later need to update that file, perhaps because the form has been updated to a new version, be sure to overwrite your old file so that all the places it's linked to will be updated as well. To update the file, first go back to the file in the folder where you put it originally and click on it. Then choose Edit, then browse for the updated version on your computer. Choose it, confirm, and click Submit. If it worked, You'll see the green bar of Go saying, Edit Successful, and congratulations, you've uploaded a new file to replace the old one. The preceding program is copyrighted by Emory University.